Hey, Randy here with Canadian Energy. So our topic today is how to maintain our off-grid system. So generally the systems aren't going to be a lot of maintenance. However, the one component that is going to be the most maintenance in, in any, any off-grid system is going to be the flooded batteries. So if you have flooded batteries, they're going to need to be watered on a regular basis. Some of the batteries have clear cases that you can easily see the levels. You know, others you need to open the caps on to see the water levels. But ensuring that, uh, that batteries are topped off, that the plates are, are fully submersed all the time is number one importance with flooded batteries. Terminal connections is the other important uh, maintenance consideration. They need to be checked and retorqued on a regular basis. I would say at least once a year. Uh, it's a good idea to also retorque any other uh, cable or bolt connections on the system, and that should be one of the few connections. Uh, but, but ensuring that, that those are retorqued Surprisingly enough, even though there's not a lot of movement there, there is some, some harmonic vibration and those, those bolts can come loose or those nuts can come loose. So, so definitely want to uh, check to make sure that those uh, are retorqued regularly. And finally, we want to make sure that the electronic components are free of any dirt and debris. So we're talking about uh, the, the inverter charger and, and charge controller. Uh, they can be fan cooled. We want to make sure that there's no manual sitting on top. Or, or underneath to restrict airflow. Also, if there's if there's any um, rodent nests or anything like that around there, we want to make sure that those are those are cleaned away. Essentially, we don't want those those devices um, sucking up any contaminants, uh, getting dirt in the board, uh, debris on the board, uh, which could cause early failure. So that's it in in the uh, series of how to maintain off grid system. Any other questions, anything on systems, please visit our website at cdenergy.com. Thanks, and until next time.